The month of April is National Donate Life Month, and many families are sharing their stories of gratitude, including a family whose son was given a second chance at life after receiving a heart transplant when he was seven months old. From the looks of it, you never know Rachel Collins' son, Mikey, has been through so much. But this little boy, who will be two this month, has already undergone multiple surgeries and received a heart transplant. Early in my pregnancy, uh, they had found some indication that he was having some issues. Uh, we didn't know specifically what between a chromosome and a heart condition, but it was determined um, that he had hypoplastic right heart syndrome. Um, which is where the right side of the heart is underdeveloped. After Mikey was born, there were more complications. And by the time he was four months old, doctors decided he needed a new heart. Just the makeup of the heart itself, the anatomy, um, the, you know, going through surgery, sometimes the heart muscle is too weak to sustain itself. Um, and this was the case with Mikey. Dr. Gerard Boyle, who is a pediatric cardiologist, says Mikey was on the waiting list for three months before they found a match. It's an eternity to a mother, but it's actually a pretty short time nowadays for our patients. Rachel says from there, doctors wasted no time getting Mikey in for surgery. Everything went well, and now he's back home and working on meeting his milestones. He now knows how to sit up. Um, he can't walk yet, but um, extremely blessed to see the strides that he's making. Rachel says she's thankful to the team of doctors who helped give Mikey a second chance at life and looks forward to making new memories with him. We want to do so many things with him this summer, go to the zoo, because we never do know what, it, what it's going to end up being.